Hey guys, it's Jordan. Welcome to One Fit City TV. I'm here with Chrissy Zakanowicz. She's a bikini model featured in Inside Fitness Magazine's Hot and Fit 100. Congratulations on that. Today, what we're gonna do is get on the mat and show you some posterior chain exercises. Now, if that sounds like gibberish to you, most people forget to work the back side of their body. They do the muscles that they can see in the mirror and that's gonna cause problems in the long run. So what we're gonna do today is go over the hamstrings and the glutes, make sure our posture is good, and really work on staying healthy with what we like to call prehab exercises. So we're gonna start with the glute ham raise. This is probably one of the hardest things you'll do and it doesn't look like it. So what we're gonna do, you need a partner or somewhere to hold your legs from here. Chris is gonna demonstrate just tipping forward just a few inches. Notice her hips are forward, her core is tight, she's engaged. This is gonna isolate the hamstrings, really work the back of those legs, you're also going to feel it in the calves, don't worry about that. It does cause cramping if you've never done this before, but again, a great way, excellent job, great way to highlight those hamstrings. From there, we're on our back. We're going to work our functional strength by putting our foot on a medicine ball. That's the stability aspect. From here, the leg comes up, we engage the core, and we really work that stability. Everything that we do here, core is engaged, hamstrings are firing, and we're getting that stability from the bottom half. This is functional training at its best. This is really gonna get those hamstrings to pop and give that added accentuation to the glutes. From here, we're gonna get on our side, so we're gonna roll that way. And again, you're gonna notice core and posture is everything. The knee travels all the way up, and the heel goes nice and high. We're gonna point our toes to the ground and drive that heel right through, perfect. Isolating those glutes and really making sure there's no motion here at the spine it's all the glute pushing. This is how we work the posterior chain. Make sure you put these exercises into your routine. Great work, try it at home.